the Himalaya Exchange has stated serious concerns about the security of its customer data. When asked to demonstrate these issues, the exchange, following its strict security protocols that encompass ID verification and artificial intelligence facial recognition via the Jumio platform, disclosed a shocking incident encountered during a customer's sign-up process. By the way, this is a disturbing image. If you have children in the room, I would not have them, I'd, I'd move them out of the room. But what I believe you're going to be seeing is an image you can see on your screen. And as you can see, if you looked at the bottom of the, the page, what that male figure is holding, I believe this serves as a stark reminder of the serious threats that you face as Chinese dissidents to its users. The Himalaya Exchange is more than a financial choice. It often serves as their only protection against the CCP's heavy-handed tactics to suppress opposition. The protection of your identities emerges as a paramount concern, underscored by this harrowing image. This event not only exemplifies the risks faced by you and other users, but also contextualizes the necessity of safeguarding your identities amidst ongoing legal proceedings. The persistent attacks against the Himalaya Exchange from large volumes of false defamatory social media and the propagation of baseless legal complaints are indicative of a concerted effort, a state-sponsored effort, to take down an entity that stands as a bastion of financial liberty and privacy. These challenges, while formidable, have only reinforced the exchange's resolve to protect its customers and to uphold its values against seemingly insurmountable odds. And a lot of the work that I've done is figuring out how we can get what we need to get done while still preserving your personal information.